This is a video to demonstrate Baldwin's drop-off and pick-up procedures. Depending on their grade level, walkers will be told which door to use to enter the school. They will walk all the way down the sidewalk until they see a staff member. They'll show their Screen and Go app confirmation for each child from that morning. They'll hug goodbye, make sure they're all ready to go, and they will walk the rest of the way on their own. Please do not pass the signs. Once they get to the doors, they will have a staff member there to take their temperature and send them in. Once they're inside, there will be another staff member waiting to make sure that they get to the proper classroom. If you have a kindergartner or a young student, please don't worry. We will make sure that they know where to go. For car riders in the morning, you will pull all the way through to the front as far as you can go. At this point, a staff member will check your screen and go and take the temperature of your child to ensure that they are good to go. The kid will get out of the car and walk to the front on their own. Thank you for staying in your car at this time. Bus riders will be dropped off at the back loop. They will stay on the bus and get off one at a time where they will step on the X's written on the ground. They will stay at the first X until the next one is available, at which time they will walk to that one. When they get to the door, a staff member will be there to take their temperature. Once they're cleared, they'll head inside where another staff member will direct them to their classroom. At the end of the day, walkers will be dismissed first. They will be dismissed from their classroom by their teacher one at a time in order to maintain social distance. They will walk down the hallway on their own until they reach the outside doors. If you have a student who is second grade or younger, they cannot walk on their own. They must have an older student accompany them. Also remember that if you are a parent, you cannot be allowed on the school premises. This includes outside the front doors. If your child cannot make it all the way home on their own, please designate a meet spot. Bus riders will be dismissed after walkers. Bus riders will be dismissed one at a time by their classroom teachers. They will maintain social distance throughout the hallway by using the black circles placed on the floor. Once they get to the back entrance, there will be a staff member ready and waiting to assist them to get on, on the bus safely. We will continue to maintain social distance throughout this time. After walkers and bus riders are dismissed, we will begin car riders dismissal. Each family will be given a family number. Even if you have three children, they will all be receiving the same family number. When you pull up in your car, a staff member will be notified using the family number that that child is ready to be picked up. The teacher will dismiss them, wave goodbye, and send them down the hallway. Remember, there are staff members that are going to be placed throughout the hallways to help our students get where they need to be. Students will walk all the way down the hallway to exit the front doors, continuing to maintain social distance. Once students exit the front doors, there will be a staff member to help them get into their car. Please remember to stay in your car at this time. Also, please note that if you are picking up an additional child as a carpool, you must know their family number. Thank you for your patience, as dismissal may take longer than usual. We can't wait to see everyone again.